Uh, so at the moment we're working in partnership with the School Sports Partnership and Derby County in the community uh, and we're delivering a healthy eating initiative in schools at the moment in North Derbyshire. We're basically looking to increase participation in PE and also um, improve eating habits and hopefully sort of in increase you know, quality of life and, and make sure everyone's really just looking after themselves. We take hold of two hours worth of curriculum time every week and we split that into one hour of, of PE where we talk about the body um, and then the benefits of exercise and then as well this, in, this, in the second hour we look at healthy eating so we look at calories, fruit and vegetables, um, different food groups, carbohydrates, proteins uh, and just make sure they've, they've basically got a well-rounded knowledge of, of what's important in terms of exercise and what, what you eat and what you put into your body. At first glance, the pancake might not look that healthy, but um, if, you, if you look at the ingredients, I mean, it's got your carbohydrates, your proteins, your calcium from the milk. You can add whatever you want to it, so you can add the fruits for extra vitamins and minerals. It's really what you add to it to, to make it more nutritious. With the pancakes, it's, it's, really, it's really good to get the kids involved. They'll love the simple recipe. It's not difficult for them to prepare. Obviously, as long as they're supervised, they'll have a, they'll have a really good time. So it's a really easy recipe, and, and they should have fun making it. To make these pancakes, you'll need some plain flour and a pinch of salt, a large egg, some semi-skim milk, some vegetable oil, a lemon, and some sugar. First of all, put the flour, salt, egg, and milk in a large bowl. Add two tablespoons of cold water and whisk it together. The batter should be quite thin. So take your non-stick frying pan, add a couple of drops of oil for each pancake. So you add in the batter, swirl it around the pan so it covers the base. Once the underside of the pancake is cooked, you can flip it over to cook the other side. Once they're cooked, you can keep them in the oven to keep them warm. Serve with quarter of a lemon and half a teaspoon of sugar. Children might prefer orange instead of lemon, just for a little bit of a change to give them the choice. If you want to, you can make the batter earlier and store it in the fridge for up to four hours. But make sure you give it a good stir before you cook it. Mmm, lovely, delicious. The good thing about the pancake, I mean, it's quick, as we say, it's quick, it, easy to make. Uh, the kids will love doing something different. It's not every day you get to, you know, get, get, get hands on with your food and obviously flipping it's a, a bit of a treat as long as you get it right. But yeah, the kid, I think the kids really enjoy it.